Hey guys, so first barn vlog since we sold my horse Athena and I'm just going to give you some updates. First of all, we still have Carbon and Dixie and Athena, if you didn't know, I sold her because I basically worked on everything with her and I am I was looking for a different horse. But we are still horse shopping. We get so close to buying one and then somebody else buys it, so that's going on. But yeah, let me just update you guys because I don't think I've done a like a barn vlog without Athena yet and last time I did one of those was probably spring or winter. So just now I had to leave the barn because there's a coyote. It's It ran into the woods but it was right over there and kind of freaked me out so I had to go chase it away because our chickens are right behind me. But I don't know, it's, it's kind of creepy. It was right there in the corner. I'll circle it when I edit. But it was, I was standing over there. So it was probably at least 40 feet away from me. And it was howling at me. So I kind of got a little bit scared. But we have chickens all along right here. So it probably wanted some of those guys. But I think now it's gone. But for now I have to wait here he's even snorting because he knows it's over there um i also had to block off this pasture coyotes don't really hurt anything but i can hear like a pack of them all the way back at our neighbors that way so yeah and this guy is also like he's snorting he knows something's up do you hear that But when it starts howling again, I'll try to get it on camera. Um, I think it's like right back there now. Focus. It's like right back there. So it, it kind of ran further into the woods once I walked towards it. But hopefully now it's gone. Also, don't be worried because if you're wondering why they don't have fly mask on, it's because I just removed them. If you don't know, um, I'm out here two times a day. I'm out here morning and night. I come out here at around 8 central time, or at the earliest. I normally don't come out here until like 10 o'clock because I sleep in, but at the earliest I'll come out here at like 8 central time and I'll put on their fly mask and bug spray them. Then it's 7 o'clock right now central time and I'll remove their fly mask and I'll grain them, do all that stuff. All right, there is your thumbnail. But yeah, Carbon and Dixie are doing completely fine. We're looking for a friend because Carbon, um, he was really depressed, like really depressed when we took Athena away. He was like that for probably a week. He was just not his normal 11 year old self. He was, he was not galloping around the pasture like he does every single day. He was just, he sat in the barn staring at the doorway and at the horse trailer 24 seven for probably almost a week straight. And Dixie, she doesn't really care as long as she has a friend period. And Dixie, she's actually been happier since Athena left because Athena, she was like really mean. She would kick her like if she got close during feeding time. And she just was not a good horse towards other horses. I don't know why he liked her, but they had a thing, you know? But anyways, I'll update you guys because you probably are kind of bored of just me talking about coyotes and other stuff. So I'll go in the barn and update you guys. First off, um, I have to close up this fence because... So when I closed off that fence, so if you didn't know, this is our second pasture. We open it up sometimes in the morning so these guys can get some extra food once they've eaten down all this. And over there it's like extra long so we open it up for like a few hours maybe 
like maybe once or twice a week so they can get a little bit of extra grass. Then we close it off. So yeah, let's go to the barn. So now we're walking to the barn. I'm trying to be as clear as possible because when I'm walking, I breathe heavy. Oh, here's our chicks, by the way. But yeah, we have, these are Polish chicken. They're just different colors. I believe this is buff laced and then that is golden Polish. We have some Americanas right there. I'm talking chicken breeds if you're not curious. We have some white leghorns. Um, I believe this is a gray cochin or white cochin. I'm not actually sure. This is, we named, she's, we named her Dominique because that's her chicken breed. And she kind of took over as being mother of all the chicks. I just love these guys, they're so cute. The cat also loves attention. We also have guinea babies still. We have a whole ton of them in the barn. This is from the one video I uploaded. We also got 400 bales for the winter because winter is coming up and we also got some extra bales for camping. So yeah, that's our hayloft now. Here's some more guinea babies that we've had in here. Um, yeah. So by the way, if you didn't know, this is our main like indoor area where the horses can come in for bad weather and stuff. Also, this is one of my newer bunnies. Um, when I come out for chores, I let her out for playtime and I give her her toys. She actually has some of her toys in here too, but she gets her toys up here too and she can just be held and loved and sometimes I'll let her go on the barn floor and she loves it. We also have this guy, but he is currently in his little cage for the night, but during the day he also gets to roam. This girl just loves her playtime. I put her up here and sometimes in the hayloft or like I said, down there and she just loves it. We got her some new toys today and she loves them. This is her by far favorite. She loves this toy. It's a little heart shape and she loves it. She doesn't like this one as much, I found out, but she still plays with it. Like she just played with it off camera. Oh, there we go. Also, if you don't know, she's a Holland Lot bunny and she's also a few months old by now. Dixie also came in here to see me so she gets a treat. I sometimes like to spoil my animals. There we go. Good girl. Good girl. Such a good donkey. But yeah, overall she's a really good donkey. She's licking her empty feed bucket. This bunny is just the sweetest thing ever. Now it's Jasper's playtime. He is our buck and he loves the cat. These two are best friends. It's kind of cute. These two just have the best time together. This is a five-year-old chicken laying an egg. If you are not aware, chickens stop laying eggs when they reach the age of four or something around there. But anyways, guys, thanks so much for watching. And I know it was quite a short one, didn't show a lot, but that's basically all that's been happening. So I'll let you guys know when we eventually find a new horse and I'll do more update videos. And thanks for being subscribed and see you next video.